What's up guys and welcome back to a new video on my channel. Today is a big day for Harrogate Town today, it's probably one of the toughest games of the season for us. It was take on Yeovil away. Yeovil are currently third in the league and have done quite well, but hopefully Harrogate Town could do quite well today because we're six unbeaten. So hopefully today Harrogate Town can pick a result. It's going to be a tough game though and I reckon it's going to be a one-all draw probably. So fingers crossed Town can get a result here, it's going to be a tough, be a tough yeah, place to go. So again, a massive thank you to Burgers and more for sponsoring this video. And if you haven't been down to the restaurant yet, Shiny Brody Burger, you need to go soon because it's one of the best burgers in Yorkshire. Anyway, we've got a lot of travelling to do today, so let's get on with it. 2-1 Who's going to score? Kieran's going to score. Kieran? Yeah. I'm going to go 1-1 one, one with Kieran to get the goal. Come on, town. Come on, town. Yeah! Cheers. Okay, thanks. Hello. Hello. What's your coverage of today's game? Um, go on then. Good job. One nil. Who's gonna score? Bad back. Got down. Score prediction? Tough game, but one all. Steve, score prediction? Uh, two on Yeovil. Really? Who's gonna score for Town? Um, Kieran. Come on, Town. <laughs>
stop that. Not looking great so far. The overall looks really, really good. You can see why they're in the league. Hopefully, they're trying to get some chances now as well. So come on. Surely, like, so it's 5 fouls now? Quite dirty ones as well. Right, we've got a free kick now, I hope we'll score that, but 30 minutes gone, no, no, come on. I'm here with Martin, what are your thoughts on half time? Well, it's been a good half, it's been a bit niggly, which I sometimes enjoy because it makes the game really open. Uh, you know, we've got a, a wet surface and, uh, you know, I think uh, we can win the game. I think this is a very winnable game and not one of the more impressive teams I've seen. Uh, we were really slack early on, really sloppy, but we've come into the game and uh, I would say we've got a fair chance of winning this game. Not, we don't need to pass it around on this kind of surface, it's slippy, I wouldn't be knocking balls down the line, up to Beck, getting little knockoffs, waiting for them to make mistakes and I'll tell you what, this game is very winnable. Mark Beck won a lot of free kicks in the first half, what are your thoughts on the performance? Oh, Beck, for me, he's had one of the best games I've ever seen him have. Um, on, a, on a pitch and conditions that are tricky, he's been almost technically the best player on the pitch. So fair play to him. He's an absolutely brilliant, you know. And he could hopefully be our match winner. Do you think Tom will win this? Oh yeah, I think, I think we're going to win this game. I'm not impressed with him. I think we've given him some half chances and I didn't see much in, in them. I think they're, I don't think they're the most intelligent lot of players at the Oval. And I think uh, we've got, we might have a little bit too much at the end. <laughs> Imagine the scenes. 
for now. We are still playing really well. Yeah, we're going to be second in the league. Third in the league, I think. We're not playing like it. We're playing insane. Come on, Sal.
come on. Well, I can't believe I'm going to say this, but Harry at the time picked up three points in the overall. It's insane to think that a couple of years ago we were in National League North and we we just beat a team who were in League One and League Two a couple of years ago. It's insane, but Harrogate Town was superb yesterday. We played amazing. We Our defence was just superb. I mean, Connor Hall would clear, clear, clear the ball off the line once. There was about three or four clearances off the line, I think. And then our attack was, again, incredible. Kieran getting the goal and Muldoon getting the goal. To be fair, one of the goals was a mistake from the other defence, but Martin Bet did well to win the ball back. And then Muldoon to finish it uh, on a one-on-one -on -one situation. So, overall, I thought Harrogate Town were the best team on the day. And it just proves that in the team, in the team of the week today, Jack Diamond got a team of the week and Sam Weaver got man manager of the week. So, it just proves that Harrogate Town played superb uh, yesterday. And it was a great result. Now, football can give you a lot of emotions. You can be happy, you can be sad. You can have your highs or you can have your lows. But one thing it also can do is it can make you meet your best mate after 30 years. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to drop a like on it, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>